Am I the A for refusing to loan my sister money for her wedding after she refused to come to mine? Hey, I'm really struggling with this one and could use some outside perspective. Here's the situation. My 30 male, younger sister, 27 female, and I have always had a complicated relationship. We love each other, but there's always been some rivalry and tension. About a year ago, I got married. I invited her to my wedding, but she declined, saying she had a work event she couldn't miss. I was hurt, but I tried to understand. It was a big deal to me, and I really wanted her there, but I didn't push it. Fast forward to now. She's getting married in a few months. Recently, she reached out to me asking for a significant loan to help cover some unexpected wedding expenses. She said they were short on funds and needed the money urgently. I'm in a stable financial position and I could afford to lend her the money, but I'm feeling conflicted. I told her that I was hesitant to loan her the money, given that she didn't prioritize my wedding enough to attend. She got really upset and said that I was being petty and holding a grudge. She argued that her situation was different and that family should help each other out when in need. I want to support my sister, but I can't shake the feeling that she didn't support me when I needed her. My wife thinks I'm in the right and that my sister needs to understand the consequences of her actions. But some of my friends think I should just let it go and help her out. So Reddit, am I the A for refusing to loan my sister money for her wedding after she refused to come to mine? Am I being too harsh and holding on to a grudge? Now for the top comments. Not the A. Why should you put family first for her when she didn't for you? She literally put her work first, the opposite of what she's telling you to do. Why shouldn't you hold a grudge and hurt feelings over that? Plus, you'll never see that money again. No, don't reward crappy behavior, hypocrisy, and entitled a-hoes. Isn't it rich when someone prioritizes themselves over being there for a close family member, but then uses the whole family needs to help each other out when in need, when they want your support? The thing is that you didn't need her money. You needed your sister to be there to support you and see you get married. And she used work as an excuse. I'm sorry. I have two brothers I'm super close to. And unless my not being at work would result in a death or bomb going off, there's nowhere else I'd be than at my brother's wedding. Let's be real. She didn't want to be there. You got married before her. More rivalry. She is likely now planning a wedding that she hopes will be better than yours and wants you to pay for it. There are no unexpected wedding expenses that require a significant loan within a few months of the wedding. My guess is that she put deposits down on expensive places and she has to pay up. When I got married, my parents paid for some, and we had to pay the rest. And of course, there were things I wanted to have, but I couldn't afford. So, I didn't have them. She could try out a loan herself, but it's likely she has no intention of paying it back. Not the A. People should not be borrowing money for a wedding. It shows terrible priorities and does not show that they are financially responsible. Unless repayment terms were in a written contract, she is a high default risk. Personally, I think she needs to grow up, live within her means, and downsize the wedding. Also, I would bet that you're not the only person she's asked for money. Everyone else probably gave a token amount or said no. I'd 100% want to know who else has been asked and how much she's begging from others. If you are inclined to do so, 
Give her a monetary gift you are comfortable giving that is an early wedding gift. You could be petty and have her sign something acknowledging that it's an early wedding gift because honestly, she sounds super unreliable. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this story, please like, subscribe, and leave a comment.